Hello, I'm the Cool Banana and welcome to Terraria Master Mode. 1.4 is here, ladies and gentlemen, and I am hyped. Right, so what I've actually done, I've gone ahead and built a house. There's a lot of slime swarming outside because the guide won't stop shooting them. They're not doing anything, man. Leave them alone. What? Like, what's your problem? You got prejudice against slimes or something, bruh. It's just not fair. Anyway, I was going to go and um, look to the right or the left of the world to see what I could get. Obviously, I have got a couple things already. Building the house, killing slimes, what have you. But it looks like what I'm actually going to have to do is dig down and get some stones so I can, you know, fight. And, you know, protect myself. I don't know. I'll make a wooden sword. That might help. God damn guy, he's nothing but a nuisance. You know? Most Terraria YouTubers hate the guide because he's not useful. No, he's useful. He means you can go on the like you don't have to tab out to go on the wiki if you've only got one monitor. Cause look, let me just go on the guide. Crafting. And uh I don't know. I'll grab some wood, one of the main crafter materials. Look at all this. Look. Cursed campfire. That's a hard mode item. He told he's literally the Terraria wiki. He is. But at the same time, all he does is attack slimes. Leave them alone, man. They're not doing anything. Anyway, as you've noticed, I've, um, if you've watched my content before, I am zoomed in. Uh, I usually play zoomed out. A nice little Terraria tree there. I usually do play zoomed out, but the thing is, is I've been watching. Uh, Chippy and Chaos play and I do feel it does make it easier for the viewer when you zoom in So unless I'm doing what I'm doing right now and exploring the map I'm gonna be complete. I'm gonna be sort of zoomed in a bit more But with stuff like this, I'm still gonna zoom out as much as I usually would but anyway, we've got a nice little cave here Oh actually goes down kind of far as well Hang on Hello, this is interesting. Is it not? Right, hang on. I've run out of torches. Brilliant. All right, let's grab some more. 18. Lovely. Bang that there. There is some iron there. I'll grab that in a minute. And we got tungsten in this world. Lovely. Do like a bit of tungsten every now and then. Uh, some red slimes. I don't want to go near them. But uh, I decided to make a medium world this time because, if again, if you watch my last playthrough, I mean, most likely you didn't. I'm not exactly popular, but... Yeah, if you watch my uh, last playthrough, I felt that my world gen was really bad for early game. And it wasn't much better in late game. It was a bit better, but not a whole lot. But anyway, I'll be right back once we've gotten out of this cave. There we go. Alright, so I've managed to get out of the cave. I used some uh, expert terraria knowledge. As you can see, I got some wood platforms and I placed them like this. Just wherever they would go is where they went. And that is not where I wanted you to go, mate. Why did you place there? That is the... Why? It's an open block, man. God. Right, let's keep... Continue on. God. I'm terrible at speaking as well. I do apologize. Oh, we got desert. Nice. Well, obviously, we've got a desert, but we found it. So, I'm going to get some cactus. Cactus armor and stuff will definitely be useful right at the start of the playthrough. I won't be using stuff like that for very long, though. Oh, yes! Oh, I forgot about this. The Oasis biome. Look at those trees. They look so cool. And those are actual palm trees, if I'm not mistaken. So we can get palm wood and use that in building almost immediately. That is fantastic. I mean, palm wood isn't my go-to building material, but it can be used for certain things. Like uh, palm wood fences, I feel are pretty good for making a good, nice, thick, early game sort of bridge pillar. If that makes sense. I also like using it for houses as well, but um, I'm sure I'll use it at some point throughout the playthrough, so you'll see what I mean. But anyway, I'm going to grab a couple of these palm trees, and yeah, we'll continue on. Alright, so I grabbed enough palm trees now, I just decided to get the two more in the middle, and I'm going to leave it there. I am tempted to get these ones here though, but you know, I'm just going to leave it. Just, just going to leave it. I've got a problem with palm trees, and... Hi. No. Yeah, I'm not... No. No. Yeah, I'm no, 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 that's fine. That's fine. Never mind. I'll be going this way. I'll see you later. Oh my god, I'm so close to death by a vulture. I'm getting so close to me, man. Eat that. Nah. They back the fuck off, slime. Open the door. Woo! 
that was a close one. That was a close one. Now what am I gonna do? Hmm. Get in the hole where I've dug stone, guide. Yeah, as you can see, I've... What's your happiness? I'm getting... <clears throat> getting... Getting this place to myself, I greatly appreciate it. I'm quite fond of wandering through the forest. I like it here. Okay, that took me forever to figure out his uh, grammar there, but that's my problem. I'm bad at English. Even though it's my first language. Work that one out. Psychologists. Yeah. Beating the system by being fucking thick. <laughs> Brilliant. But right, yeah, I've got some stone so we could uh, make an furnace. And furnace is made. Uh, and furnace will go up there. That was a mistake, but I don't give a no dams because I can make a cactus sword, which is yummy. And then I'm going to make a cactus pickaxe. And then what I'm going to do is I'm also going to make an cactus helmet. And I'm going to pop that on my head without stopping the recording because I'm using Xbox Game Bar. And the overlay decided the best place it could go was exactly where I go to select housing and all that stuff. So that, yep, thanks Game Bar. And I can't move it either, so well done. Brilliant. Cactus lamp, yes. This palm wood is going to come in handy. Palm wood breastplate, haha, <laughs> breast. And wooden greaves, uh, specifically palm wood greaves. Is that four damage? Yeah, yeah I, don't, I don't want four damage. I would much rather six. Thank you very much, matey boy. There we go. Why can't you make cactus bows? I've just realized this. Get on it. Get on it. You know that should have been in this fucking update. Get on making goddamn cactus bows. And I have spent literally half my wood on that. I thought I spent all of it for a second there. I was looking at the palm wood. So that, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Right, so I'm going to make some flaming arrows. Right, now I'm ready to take this motherfucker on. I want that fallen star. Right, open that door. Get the slimes on the roofs first. Yep, get up there, slimes. Grab that, shoot and run, and shoot. Yep, I've got this sussed. I've got him done. Okay, hello. I didn't even know this was here. Hello. A nice little cave. I can get a better shot on you. Look at that! The game's out. Ba 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 ba. Not that close, mate. I'm not that. I, I don't like signatures. Someone would want. If someone would want my signature. <laughs> A chest. Did I land there? Yes, I did. Iron skin. Yum. Can of worms. Loot. Yes. I got. Oh yes. No, that's really nice. I can start fishing early now. No, I like that. I really wanted something that could push you to do fishing earlier. And to be fair, at the start of the game, it is quite difficult. I do apologize that I'm working in the dark right here as well. But I've got no torches. So <laughs> I'm just going to grab this iron ore that we all kind of saw. And <laughs> Well done, Connie. You're so good at YouTube. Well done. No wonder no one's subscribed to your channel yet. <clears throat> That's not true, Connie. You've got to 208 in the past couple of episodes. Don't be ungrateful. Thank you, everyone who subscribed recently. I really appreciate it, genuinely. But anyway, enough of that. I'm going to be right back once I am out of this predicament where I can't see fucking anything. So, yeah, I'll see you in a sec. He fucking... He's got a brain! I thought that was the point of zombies. They, they want... I don't know. Okay. Well then. I'm happy about that. Oh my god. Our moon is fucking amazing. Oh, no way. No way we got that one. That was the one I saw when I first logged on to the game. Because I've been on and off it a few times now. Because uh, I was kerfuddling about with trying to get Team Mod Loader to work. Just had to install the Steam version. It was no kerfuffle. I was making it harder on myself like I usually do. Didn't scroll down far enough on the Team Mod Loader page to find the install button. Big brain right here, ladies and gentlemen. Big brain. And I got stressed about it as well. I got genuinely stressed out about it. So, yeah, I am an extremely large large brain. 
Enchanted night. Oh, I've got to do this. I'm making them. I'm doing fishing. Fishing. Yes. Yes. I'm fishing. Fishing is fun. Well, it's not, but you know what I mean. Make a wood fishing pole. Thank you. But yeah, I'm definitely doing fishing. But uh, anyway, I'm going to wait until it's daytime because I have no source of making torches because I spent it all on flame and arrows because I'm intelligent. So yeah, I will see you once it's daytime again. Oh, actually, before we go, if you look to sort of the middle of the screen right now into the background, and now you wouldn't be able to see this as well if you didn't ha if you have backgrounds on. I'm not sure, but like. Because I have to play without backgrounds on because, well, as you saw there, I'm still getting a couple frame drops now. But there was the Eye of Cthulhu. He was in the background flying around. And now that is really ominous, but I love it so much. Honestly, that's one of my favorite things about this update. They really have gone all out for it. Even if there are a couple things that I wanted that might not be in it. The game is running smooth as beans. You know, even though I'm having the couple frame drops every now and then. It's running a lot nicer than it was. Um, like, uh, how do I put this? Modded Terraria ran better than regular Terraria for me before. But this version is running absolutely beautifully. Couldn't complain, really. Because the lag the lag drops are nothing compared to what they were before. 19! Where did, where did I get them? Where did they come from? What? Okay. Okay, no, nope, we're going mining then. Okay, never mind. Never mind, it was like a five second jump cut. Well, that was worth it. Let's go. Let's go! Yay, I can see what's in the caves. Oh, that motherfucker's still there! He is a persistent motherfucker, isn't he? Get out of it. Go on. Why don't these poison him? I have questions. Alright, I've had enough of these motherfucking zombies. I am putting him down once and for all. He's never gonna cut. Hi, Moon. He's never gonna cut. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I can't go. You wanna die, zombie? I don't wanna die. I want you to fucking die. I can't fucking see shit. There's a chest there. Die. Thank you. Oh, that was some expert plays right there. This is master mode. Damn it. It's not good enough. Your expert is not good enough. Spear. That. Does the same damage, but it's piercing. I feel like it could be useful. Not gonna lie. And I should probably have a brain about me and start picking these chests up. Because I don't think... Oh, salvation! I used all my other potions, but I don't give a damn! No! Okay, no damage was taken. That's fine, then. Oh, caves. Yum. You know, that's cool, actually. I'm gonna start doing... Uh, what Chippy did in his uh, early 1.4 Let's Play thing that he was doing. Uh, I might start like an underground village at some point. That'd be pretty cool. A step stool. That's going to be really nice for me. Yeah, that step stool is going to be really, really, really nice. Oh my god, another chest. See, this is why I like medium worlds. And another shine potion. You're not searching around the entire world for literally... Some of the recordings for the last series would go on for hours. This has been a perfectly fine episode, and it's uh, 20 minutes at the moment I've been recording. And I'm probably only going to have to record for a couple more minutes, because I haven't cut out much. You know? <laughs> but at least I can imagine I'm not going to have to... Oh! Oh my god, yes! Oh, this is the Xbox music! Oh my god, I haven't heard this in so fucking long! I haven't heard this since I played the Xbox 360 version. No joke, about four or five fucking years ago. Oh my god. I want to cry. No, give it back! How do I get this? It's an overworld theme. I want to know what the overworld sort of theme is for. Is it the new rain theme? If this is the rain thing, I'm getting back to the top and I'm seeing this. Hang on. Nah, fuck those oars. I need to see this. No! No, 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 no! Give it back! Give it back, no! Is that like under... No. No! Give it back! Give it back. No. I just got to the surface as well, you cunt! Apologies for my language there, but 
Like, I haven't heard that in so long. I am genuinely a little bit emotional right now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm not crying or anything. No, no, not that stupid. Don't worry, don't worry. But no, no, no. I am genuinely, like, having a nostalgia overload right now. I, on, I want to cry. Like, through happiness that they've added that back. Oh my god. Well, I say added it back. They've added it to PC. Because I fucking loved that theme. That was my favorite thing about Xbox. And you know what the thing is? I'm pretty sure on the Xbox 360 version, you could only get it on the tutorial world after a while. Mining potions, lovely. Well, the, the console version, I think. Don't quote me on that, though. I don't know. And then Anvil, lovely. That was a gold chest. Did I get any weapons from that? No, I got uh, shoe spikes there. Oh, is auto pause on? Why is auto pause on? Auto pause is not on. What? Oh, no. Wrong button, never mind. I was being brain dead. I got both. I got the climbing claws and the shoe spikes. No way. Can be worn in vanity slots. Does that mean you just wear them like that and you can use them or? Oh my. Yes. This is so lucky. I've got climbing claws. And there's a loom. I'm having that. You know, I'm taking all of this. I'm even taking the wolves. I'll be right back once I've demolished this entire thing. Alright, so I've demolished all of the back wall. So I've got that now. And what I'm going to do actually is I am going to take this mining potion to make my life just a little bit easier. There you go. That's about the mining speed of a platinum pickaxe. That's quite nice. Alright. So I want to see what's in there. We got that iron ore there. I have been down here, but I did, don't think I came further than this before. So I'm going to go have a look, see what that is. Well, we bleh, bleh, bleh. no, I won't. Never mind. The hole's there. Yummy. I wonder what, um, like, final ore we've got as well, like, as in platinum and gold. I wonder which one of those we got, because we got gold last time. So hopefully we've got platinum, just to mix it up. That's what I would like for these series, these Terraria series that I'm doing. It's to sort of have it be slightly different every time with the different materials and whatnot. But uh, obviously with building, the material's going to be dependent on preference. I will go in another world and get some copper if it's just for a build, if you know what I mean. But I wouldn't go into a world because I'm struggling to find titanium and just say, oh, fuck it, if I get adamant, I'll get that. No, 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 I wouldn't do anything like that. Or go into a different world and, like, take, uh, I don't know, like, I don't know, weapons or something from another world. No, that shit's, like, fucking, fuck that. Fuck that shit. Uh, obviously, no shame on you if you do do it. If, that, if, you, if you're struggling with a boss, fair enough, and you want to just get past it, that's no problem. I've done that before. Just the thing is, now I've played the game enough and I know I can beat the bosses, it just takes me a lot, it can just take time. I want to, you know, beat the game in a more pure way, if that makes sense. So don't feel bad if you do, sort of, I won't say cheat, but I will say cheat just for point of reference, if that makes sense. Oh, that's a lovely bit of iron there, but, uh, that's a worm. And there's lightning going on outside as well. In Terraria, not in real life, thankfully. Whoa! Is this boy's AI been buffed or some shit? There you go, look at that. Oh my god, this spear is good. I love piercing damage. Get him. Get him. Got him. Lovely. Right, let's get that iron. Alright, so I found a lovely little cave, and it's got a house. Oh, that is tasty. Thank you, Terraria. This world gen is definitely better than the last world we had. A million times better. And, uh, well, the potions in it aren't the best, but at the end of the day, we have been quite lucky this playthrough. I can't complain. Yeah, that's a wood bow. I'm going to stick that in there. And I, uh, I do want these shoe spikes for selling. So I'm going to grab those. I'm going to, I want cobwebs. that can go in there and I'm gonna grab these recall potions and I'll get rid of the copper pickaxe no nope, I will get rid of the wooden sword because a copper pickaxe probably sells what like more than that but uh, anyway there's also a bit of iron here so I'm gonna grab this a sec lovely jubbly I 
My shine potions ran out, motherfucker. And there's actually a potion statue here, and I quite like the look of it, not gonna lie. So I'm gonna pick that up, and then we'll open that. And there is a boulder trap there. That is pretty sneaky. Can they activate that? Nope. Alright. Well, they can't anymore, anyway. There's a load of slimes coming down. I'm just gonna... But, but, but lads. Lads. I dropped the gold. Oh, my God. You know, I do really like the fact, as well, that they've got the uh, timer in it now. Whoa, this thunderstorm music is fucking dope. Not gonna lie, I really like this. But anyway, I'm gonna build around these houses. That's what I'm gonna do for the rest of the rest of this episode is some uh, building because I've had a few people say they like my build. So I'm gonna actually sort of show how I do it in a sense. So I'm just gonna sort of try and build a nice little sort of looking roof for the guide's house here. Out of stone, like that. Obviously, this is at the start of the playthrough, so I'm quite limited in what I can do. But I am gonna try and do something vaguely creative at the moment. I really like this music. It is so over the top, but it's so cool, if that makes sense. Right, so I'm thinking that'll be too thick. Right. Oh, hello, there's a pinky. How are you doing, lass? Do you, do you want to take me on? You do want to take me on. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Bring it. Bring it. Oh, God, you caught me in a lag spike. You are not fair. That is not... That's plain dirty, pinky. That is plain absolutely filthy. Yeah, how much health has this thing got? Oh, my... Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, so Pinky's nearly down. This has taken absolutely ages. It's nearly nighttime. This is... No, go away. Right, can you die now? How much health have you got? There's got to be one more shot. One more now. No. Six. Okay, there you go. Three gold. All right, that was worth it. Not going to lie. And I'm going to stick that gold in this chest because we haven't got a money trough. I'm going to stick two of it in here. Leave one on me for the merchant. And uh, what I'm actually going to do... A sec. Let's kill this flying fish. What I'm actually going to do is uh, build up some materials quickly so I can get building. And then I'll be right back. Alright, so I've gone ahead and got the materials in my inventory that I'm going to want to use for building. Uh, if there's anything I want to change, like the stone, I can just craft that anyway. That's not going to be a big deal. But, um, right, that should be fine like that. Okay. I don't like that. Nope, we're not having that. I, that is horrid. Oh, my God. Get, get, get out of it. Thank you. go. <clears throat> is it a furnace? It's actually a furnace. What the hell? I didn't know that. Okay. Right, you can go away, zombie. I am not putting up with you today. Go. Out, get out of it. Get out of it. Thank you very much. <clears throat> right, now with the grey brick, I am going to line these two edges here, like so, and then lock swap like that go. Actually, no, never mind. I've got a different idea. Right, so I'm going ahead and replacing the uh, stone brick, uh, no, the um, wood roof with stone brick instead of doing it the other way around and having a wood roof. Because I think this will look a little bit better, if that makes sense. I'm also going to uh, put a bit of stone brick into the floor if I don't get killed by the zombie first. Right, there we go. See, this spear is actually really nice for very early game, if that makes sense. So, uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this wood. I'm going to stick it there. And then we're going to hammer this down to make it look like a support beam. Like this. The demon eye go away. There we go. That's the first bit done. That looks quite nice. Oh my god! He detonated me. What a beast. He absolutely exploded my corpse. Go on. There you go. That boy is dead. And I've got my gold back. Lovely. And I am no longer going to be screwing over my builds. Now that is tasty. Now what I'm actually going to do, I think, because of all the enemies and it being night time, I'm actually just going to build another layer on top of this instead of building another house. And then from here, I'll build sort of a basis of a village, if that makes sense, of sort of 
funky looking two how like two story houses. I think that'll be pretty cool. I might incorporate this into maybe sort of like a three story with a bit coming off of um, coming off to the side over here later on. I don't know. I'll figure it out as we go along. So yeah, I'll be right back once I've essentially duplicated the uh, bottom layer up here. So I'll see you in a sec. Oh, it is back. All oh, the glorious music has returned. <clears throat> oh, that is really nice. I'm going to say, I think they've retextured a uh, stone brick wall. I really like the uh, look of it now. It's really nice. Can I just say that? Anyway, I'm going to use this to emulate pillars in a sense. And, uh, oh, my music's gone again. God damn it, Terraria. Every time I say, oh, I love this, it's like it just like, oh, well, I'll turn it off then. Thanks, Terraria. Thank you. All right, there we go. I've got that there. And what I'm going to do is I'll probably stick a fireplace down where that uh, workbench is at the moment. Obviously, all of this is going to be moved. I'll make my own little base as well where all my operations go on. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to get on with making this uh, roof. I am going to make it look a little bit different. So I'm not too sure on that roof design, hence why I decided to actually... Um, do what I've done here and put this second stack on top of it because I wasn't sure on the way that looked to be completely honest. All right so this is the uh, finished house as you can see because I've got two rooms set up the uh, merchant has showed up which is very nice and uh, off camera what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna build myself like my own little base but that'll be something I'm building in my own time and then I'll build all the NPCs uh, houses on camera. I feel like that's a nice way to go about it but um yeah, what I actually did for this ladder here was take uh, stone uh, stone platforms and wood platforms and I hammered them down so that they're a level down because I really like the way that looks. Uh, but uh, anyway, that's all about I can fit in for today's episode. Um, I think we got a decent bit done. Uh, we didn't get much in terms of equipment, but we did get a, a lot of terms in... A lot in terms of like experience and we got a lot of iron bars and stuff actually speaking of those iron bars before i end the video i'm gonna go ahead and make an upgrade to our stuff right uh iron pickaxe that's number one priority because that is slightly better then i'll go for a wooden bow which is very nice uh and do i have enough for a bucket Yes, I do. So I'm going to take an empty bucket as well. Okay. All right. So with that, that's going to uh, finish off this episode of Terraria Master Mode here. I'm pretty sure I said expert mode earlier. But uh, yeah, if you liked it, leave a like. And if you want me to actually start trying to make build videos in the future, just let me know down below and I will start trying to do them. But anyway, thank you again for watching this episode of Terraria Master Mode. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. Goodbye.